Hello guys, Dadja Hao. Shin Yen Kwai Le. Happy Chinese New Year. What a couple of weeks it's been, eh? Me, China, and the coronavirus. I've had my family, I've had my friends, I've had you wonderful fans asking me, Are you okay? Do you have the coronavirus? Are you quarantined? I'm going to address all of these things today and talk to you about this time that we have to really make the most of our time. Not to procrastinate. No procrastination. First things first, am I quarantined? Pretty much, yes. I'm stuck in my apartment here in Shanghai. People are still outside. I have been looking out the windows and I have seen people walking around. I don't think it's a good idea. I think I'm going to stay in. I did actually do a supermarket run a few days before, before they announced that you should probably stay indoors. I have stocked up on fruit and vegetables, meats, potatoes, rice, pasta, all stuff that's really good for you, stuff that's nutritious, that's gonna keep you going, keep your spirits up. Also, on the first few days when we could go outside, I did buy a little sachet of cat food, and there's a cat outside my apartment, an abandoned kitty. So I've been making sure that I feed up my little apartment cat outside. And this week's really been an opportunity to cook again. I usually do my cooking at the weekends, but I've been cooking every day. It's really great fun. I haven't been relying on why am I, which I sometimes have a cheeky why am I here in China. Really fulfilling to get back in the kitchen, do some cooking, good old homegrown cooking, yeah. So my two main focuses this week was to stay healthy and to use my time wisely. Regarding the coronavirus and actually staying healthy, I have been wearing my mask, I've been washing my hands a lot more than I guess I usually would. And it's a good lesson going forward as far as keeping healthy is we need to make sure that we're definitely making sure our hands are washed and really washed thoroughly. And to stay healthy and to have a proper spring clean, I did a really deep clean of my apartment. It's quite therapeutic actually, to that state of zen. If you didn't check out my video on top 10 things to do before 9am, I've stayed pretty rigid to that. Although running outside or doing cardio has been a little bit challenging. Been doing a lot of working out, a lot of stretches, a lot of push-ups. I've been doing some yoga as well, some abs. Really keeping myself fit and healthy, keeping physically strong and mentally strong. I've been doing lots of reading, I've been doing lots of studying, brushing up on my Chinese again. And importantly, I've been working on videos for you guys. It's been a great opportunity for me to really think about the direction of the channel and the kinds of videos that I want to do. I've been really trying to connect with you fans and really making sure that we're all in this together. We're building the, the morale and camaraderie together. The last couple of weeks has been a really great time to do some work as well. You know, I've tried to stick to kind of a nine to five schedule as well as far as getting work done, getting videos done and making sure that I stay efficient. And this brings me to one of the main messages of this video is to really use your time wisely. Just because you're indoors doesn't mean you can just lay on the couch and be a couch potato. It's a time to really capitalise on your time and make the most of it. Learning new skills, when you're in a quarantined situation, sometimes it's good to learn something new or get around to things you said you were gonna do in the past and just do them. So this week I've been obviously brushing up my Chinese. I've been learning a lot about finance and economics this week. Something else that I did that's really important and I recommend you all do this. When I was going through my wardrobe, I was picking out clothes that I know I don't really need anymore put them in a big box, and I'm gonna donate these clothes after this quarantine period has passed. It's also been a time of reflection. I've really thought about my life, what I wanna do going forward. Message me below on what you've thought about. Think about your goals. I still recommend that you check out some great TV shows and movies during this time. In the day, if you've got a couple of hours, I think there's nothing wrong with checking out a movie or checking out a TV series. One I recommend at the moment which I was gripped by, is Making a Murderer. Really fascinating series. Check it out. I'll put all of this information in the description below. Guys, don't worry. I'm here and I'm healthy. I'm feeling good. I'm positive. I really believe China's doing everything it can to combat this virus. I really want to hear from you guys. I want to hear words of encouragement. I want to hear what you guys have been up to. What have you guys done to stay healthy and stay positive? A lot of you guys will say, I'm too busy. I don't have enough time. Don't procrastinate. Do something great. And carry this forward into the future. I hope you've had a pleasant and a really lovely time with your friends and your family during this challenging time. Lots more videos coming your way. So watch this space. I hope everyone's healthy. I hope everyone's well. Jai Wuhan. Jai Zhongguo.